She's a baby. She's a baby. She loves bread and bananas. Maybe this needs to be smaller for her. She's a baby. It's bath time. Time to take a bath. She doesn't want to, but she has to. She's a baby. She's tired. She's so brave. <laughs> okay, let's go. Amy's first bath, as far as I'm aware, so she's probably really not gonna like this, but my mom says she's stinky and we need to give her a bath, so if she's stinky, we need to give her a bath. <laughs> Lukewarm water. Oh, baby. Organic soap. <laughs> nice and frothy. Careful not to get it on her face because I don't want it to get in her eyes. But I did my research and they said either pet shampoo or gentle human shampoo. This is gentle shampoo. Actually, it's just bar soap. Gentle. B, I really expected her to scream. She's not screaming. She loves me already. I'm her mama. Look. Aww. Hey, my mama. I was gonna use the regular shower, but I felt like that might scare her a lot more. So we're just gonna use the jar. <laughs> you're seeing is hair just like your hair only better maybe now just a little bit on her face just get her quiet yeah she's actually doing amazing considering my mom just got her so we're just trying to like get her used to people and if you have any experience with pigs, you know that usually they squeal. And she really has not done that at all. She's such a good girl. <coughs> and now she's all clean. Yay! Okay, let's put her put her in a blanket. <laughs> Oh, 
Now the next important step when bathing your pig is to stay hydrated. So today we have Gorilla Mine, collagen peptides. Let's go. She's seeping. She's only a baby. She's seeping. Oh. Next thing's next. Time to oil our pig. Keep her skin moist and fresh. Big reveal. <laughs> okay. Oh, by the way, some info on her. She's a Cooney Cooney Juliana mix, apparently, according to my mother. And um, she doesn't have a name. I'm thinking Artemis, but open to suggestions as well. Look how fresh and moisturized she looks. This is literally a boy. <laughs> Bro, my mom said it was a girl. This is a boy. This is Peter. <laughs> and that's his balls. Mom, this is a boy. Oh, yes? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You sure? Uh, he has a PDs and balls. Okay. Okay. Bye. But he's really good. Okay, bye. I love you. Bye, I love you. Okay. <laughs> Look at him. New name suggestions, Apollo, Artemis' twin brother, or something else, I don't know. Wow. Maybe Hermes? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Me, baby. Aww. He's so smart and handsome. He's a baby. This is where he's seeping for now until we can get him his own castle and a little bed because he deserves it. God, he's amazing. He's incredible. Let me get the light on him. Final part of today's video, we are going to do a small unboxing because I have acquired quite a few packages Ow! in my P.O. box because I haven't picked up for a little bit, but um, one in particular I have been expecting, excited for, and another one that I realized um, this person has sent me at least two things and the first thing I didn't open because it was addressed to someone else, so I thought, oh, this must be an accident, so I was going to take it back to the post office. But I got a little lazy. Anyway, and I didn't. Good thing I didn't because um, you'll see. So, if your name is Sarah B, I'm not gonna say the full name for you know confidentiality, but Sarah B, and you have sent at least two packages to my PO box, I would like to thank you. And sorry I didn't open the last one in the last video because I was confused. But I did open the second package because I was like, that's so odd that I would get two mistaken packages to my P.O. box. And I know the guy that had the P.O. box before me because I get his government mail all the time and I give it back to the post office. Anyway, so I opened the second package and it was this very fitting for today's video. Little Inosuke, 
charm thing? Ooh! A Nosuke AirPod case. That's cute. And a Nosuke key charm. Okay, so now I can add him onto my collection. I got this little Masubi. I think this was from Spicy. And this little handmade little uh, zipper charm that I put on here. So this is perfect. Thank you, Sarah. And this is the first package that was sent that I didn't open because uh, I was confused. But let's open it now. It says, I hope you enjoy your gifts. You're such a wonderful and wholesome person. And of course, I love your content. Thank you so much from Sarah B. Thank you, Sarah B. Dancing Squidward when he's off, you know, off the sauce. Thank you, Sarah. I love the gifts and they're fantastic. Thank you. And thank you for the support with the channel. Now, the second box is a box I have been expecting. This one is from a company. The company is called Cobalt Cutlery, and he specializes in knives, swords, weaponry, I believe. So he was kind enough to custom make me some Enosuke swords. So let's open them and see. So in forming these, we had agreed to not make them like actually sharpened functional blades and basically just make them like training prop blades. But these mofos are sharp as frick. So they will definitely be decoration and also maybe props, but mainly beautiful decor. All right, awesome possum. Everybody, thank you for watching. Um, I do have a lot of other packages from my PO box left still. So I was thinking either make another video for that or do something else. Like start opening them on stream or something. I'm getting this room set up uh, for streaming again on Twitch, most likely. But uh, yeah, comment below if you are interested in seeing that one place or the other. I always love hearing from you. Please don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and leave a silly comment below. I'll see you in the next one, and adios!